You were right. I wasn't expecting that. I don't know what it is, but I love it. She's going to toast up the intestine for us. <laughs> oh, I need help. Are you brave enough? This is exactly what we came here for. That was kind of surprising, what actually. A what a highlight. We have made it to Caron. We're in the Caron town and today we're just gonna walk around. We're gonna experience what it's like here in Caron. I'm sure it's a different vibe to El Nido since we're on a remote island in the middle of the Philippines. Caron is known for lagoons, snorkeling, diving. They are shipwrecks, beautiful islands and beaches to see. And we're gonna try and do as much of it as we can in the time that we are here. But today, let's go out, explore, see what the Caron town is like. Caron is a municipality in Palawan and it makes up part of the Calamian Islands. And Caron Island is one of those islands, but we are staying in Caron town proper, which is the west side of the bigger Beswanga Island. We've actually been so lucky to see so many sides of the Philippines in just a short amount of time. And what I've already noticed is that every place we go, the tricycles look completely different yeah. to other cities, like in Manila or even in El Nido, which is just a short boat ride away. The tricycles already have their own style or their own unique look. It's Definitely. actually really cool. We thought Caron would be completely dead and quiet because of the situation. But it does seem that there's some energy, some people are coming back. We have seen a few tourists since we arrived. Even though the main attraction here is obviously the incredible island hopping, but we really like to go and explore the town, get the lay of the land, see what everything is about, get ourselves settled into a place, find out what's happening before we go on the island tours. So how we got to Caron is we had to take a ferry from El Nido to Caron town. And the ferry cost us 2,650 pesos each. It was a little expensive in my opinion. We do think it was a little expensive, but it's okay. Online it said it was two and a half hours on the ferry, but it took five hours. Unfortunately, it was really long and really bumpy. So I don't know if we would recommend it, but it was an experience. No, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> they ask us for a tricycle about every five seconds. Yes. They want to take us to a beach or somewhere, which is so sweet. Or a hot spring. I, who don't normally feel seasick or motion sick at all, I felt very, very sick on the ferry. So did I. We will put all the details to how we booked the ferry in the description below. It looks like a spring roll. Yeah. yeah. we can try one. It's a spring roll with potato inside. Whoa, no way. It looks so good. And this looks good too. It looks like it's got some coconut. I got my little vinegar in a packet. I don't know how to do it. You have to bite it. You have to bite it again. And these are only 15 pesos. Really delicious. It's like a spring roll. This makes it. I think I could have these for breakfast maybe every day. <laughs> I think something we like to do when we go to a new place is just eat some of the food. It kind of always gives us a vibe of what the place is like. Or anything that we can find that looks amazing. So couldn't say no to the spring roll. This is what we really do. Shev just walks around the town finding I don't dogs. Like that he's, tied up. I just he's, want to he's in a little bit of a parking spot right now. He's just waiting. You're waiting for your owner. We've just found a cute coffee shop called Epic Coffee, and I've decided to get an iced latte. I got a hot latte. So we're just going to enjoy this, and then I think we 
me to do some more exploring of the town. Real quick, we want to say a big thank you to Surfshark for continuing to sponsor this channel and for keeping us safe with the best VPN on the internet. If you don't know what a VPN is, it stands for Virtual Private Network, which encrypts all of our information sent between our devices and the internet, making sure all of our personal information is safe and protected. Whilst we're on epic adventures here in the Philippines, we are constantly having to use public Wi-Fi in cafes, hotels, and airports, which leaves our information vulnerable and available to hackers. But it's more than just online security. For a mere $2.49, you can get access to the full internet. It's so easy to change your virtual location and get access to a wider variety of content. We highly recommend Surfshark as we've been using it here in the Philippines and it has been a lifesaver, literally. We urge you to get yourself and your data secure as it is so important, especially while you're traveling. One account for unlimited devices and a 30-day money-back guarantee so there's no risk to try it out. Use the promo code SHEVENDEV to get 83% off plus an extra three months for free or click the link in the description box below to get started. Okay, back to eating street food. Now that we're a little hydrated and had a coffee, we have been wanting to try some local Filipino food. And now that we're in Quran, we're gonna go and try some things that you guys have recommended to us. So we're looking for a Filipino street food kind of place. Yeah. Something very local that we can try. Oh yeah, the more local, the better. Hello. 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 What is this lady yeah, Should we go and try? Let's go see. Oh, barbecue. Barbecue. Yeah. It smells so good. Pork intestine and then liver and pork. Ooh. Ah, oh, cool. oh, intestine. Yes. Okay. Liver, pork. Are you brave? Okay. Are you brave enough? Yeah, let's do it. Why not? <laughs> Why not? Okay. How, how much? Okay. okay. It's ready. It's ready. Yeah. It's okay. Ready. <laughs> oh, what's this? Vin ask by ass. Sweet vinegar, this one spicy yes. vinegar. Okay, I like the spicy one. This I looks wanted. delicious. So I'm just gonna try the pork one. I, I just dip it in. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Wow, wow look that's at so that. cool. It's absolutely delicious. That's fresh, right on the street. The vinegar is a highlight. Oh. I dip again? Okay. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I love that. One more just, dip. Just dip it in the vinegar. More sweet. More sweet. More sweet, and this one is a little sour from the vinegar, oh. but it's delicious. And I double dip. <laughs> oh, this is so good. <laughs> good? Mm. This is so good. Sweet. Yes. We have to try the yeah. right? yeah. Okay. Which one is the best? Both. See? Say? Yes. Liver and Plus. intestine. Oh, okay. The, you recommend, right? <laughs> Oldest barbecue in Quran. Yes. Yeah. This is the oldest. Like wow. the old recipe. Wow. 25 years. Wow. Okay. Which okay. one should we go for? Uh, both. Yes. Okay. <laughs> one of each. One of each. Okay. Okay. okay so I'm gonna take. This is the liver. liver. The liver. Yes. Okay. I'm gonna take the liver and just. Yes. You can dip Which it one? here and then here. Oh. Okay. Wow. So first yes. here. Uh, welcome to the like blood. This. <laughs> Good. It's delicious. Mm. She told me, and she was right. She was right. <laughs> what do you think of liver? Before, I would never have eaten it. This is really good. Yeah. It's all about the sweet and sour dipping. Yeah. I love the skill. Great. Okay, she's gonna toast up the intestine for us. <laughs> what do you recommend? The vinegar. The vinegar. <laughs> so they know. <laughs> it's good. Mm. Wow. Surprisingly, this is my favorite one. Really? Mm. I'm surprised. It's my here, turn. Here we go, my girl. You were right. I wasn't expecting that. I would have never imagined saying this is my favorite. But it is. We need to say sabor. 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 Yeah. sabor. Um, it means delicious. Ah, delicious sabor. Yeah. Okay. Thank you for letting us know. Sabor. 
Wow. wow, we're learning. We're learning something new, sabo. Very, very delicious. You can keep the change. Thank you, <laughs> Thank you so Thank much. You so much. And nice to meet you guys. Bye-bye. Nice bye. Wow, that was kind of surprising what actually. A what a highlight. I love that they give us tips and recommendations as you guys do every time. Where we go, what to do, what to eat. And it just makes our trip so much more enjoyable so thank you wow <laughs> on to that was, awesome. else. that was awesome that I was really try cool something else it just gives me more feeling to go and try other things what what else <laughs> we can't tell you enough how we appreciate your recommendations your friendliness it's just world class i think it's why people fall in love with the philippines for sure it's the people it's all about the people yeah it really shows how people can make your place that was kind of deep, right? Yeah, and they can make your experience good or bad. Yes. So true. <laughs> Somebody's brakes need some work. I've just seen this place. I have no idea what it is. But there's a sign outside that says it's only two pesos. So we well, we got to go and try. Out. So we need to find out what can the sell is. There are baking in the back. Look at all of them. I think what? this is it. They look so good. Uh, it is a bread. Uh, bread. Can you bring a bread? You can bring a bread. Moringa leaves. Moringa leaves. Oh, oh, moringa leaves. Okay. Okay. okay Should we try? Should we try some? Yeah. Can we get maybe a few? Yeah. Can we get like five? <laughs> some Filipino bread. This is so cool. This is the kind of stuff that I wanted to experience and taste that's only here in the Philippines. So he's got a big crate, like a cooler box with a whole lot. And they're almost finished. Only 10 pesos Let's for see. five. They're piping hot too. Those are like fresh out the oven. Oh my God. Oh my God. That's soft. French. Soft, warm. Okay, I have to get in on this. Loads are coming out the oven. It's absolutely delicious. This is definitely really my new favorite thing. Mm. Great. <laughs> hey, how are you? Hi. Good game. Hey, Who, <laughs> who's winning? Who's winning? Oh. No, 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 no. You're too good. Later. Later. <laughs> Later. Later. Yes. Have a good day. Oh, okay, we will come. Can, we will come back. We will come. Thank you. I love that. They were just playing a game of chess but invited us to join. Oh, so cute. Should we get a lemonade? Yeah. and actually squeezed the proper way and I can't tell you when last I actually had freshly squeezed lemonade it's not sour at all it's sweet it's refreshing mm. they all look good <laughs> maybe the purple one yeah can we have uh, one of these one of these. Uh, oh wow. Ten pesos or what? This one is bread. And this one is cookies. Cookies. I'm going to try the Spanish bread first. And I love that it's like this yellow color. Very soft, squishy. Mm. Mm. It's just like a sweet loaf of bread. Would you like some Spanish bread? Say yes. He doesn't like it. You don't want? You don't want? Spanish bread? No. Bye bye. And then this, which he said was like a cookie, it is so hard. Whoa. Whoa. Mm. Look at that. This is so good. It's like a giant cookie, but maybe closer to like a shortcake or a shortbread, something like that.
Caron is a bustling town. I think we've ended up in like peak hour traffic. It's so busy, noisy. I was not expecting this on a quaint little island. I'm so happy about this because everything is open and we get to just be in the hustle and bustle of this little town. For all our Thai viewers, we have found Thai food. Uh, Om's Thai. It looks so good. It's lechon. Lechon. Chicken lechon. Chicken lechon. Oh. Chicken lechon. Ah. Chicken lechon. Yeah. And the pork is liempo. Liempo. Oh, okay. Ah, okay. We are going to try one of the highly rated Filipino delicacies, and that's lechon, which is like grilled chicken. Yeah. We couldn't help ourselves when we walked no. past. It was smelling so so good. We we're like. Okay, we have to stop and try. This has turned into almost like a food vlog or us trying different food, but just walking around the city, we've been attracted to so many different things to snack on and eat. So we couldn't help ourselves. So I hope you've enjoyed watching us try different food today. Well, this is exactly what we came here for. We came to get totally stuck into the culture. And I have to say, this has been something that I would highly, highly recommend that you try. What is your nationality? South Africa. South Africa. Same. Yeah. Same. <laughs> 150. For half a chicken. For half a chicken, that's a lot. <laughs> a lot of chicken. Do you recommend? Look at that. Ooh, it's piping hot. My good old fashioned vinegar sauce. So I've also got my calamansi lime, which I'm just gonna sprinkle all over. We just kind of made the side booth our little... Workstation. Workstation. <laughs> and he's given us this to be a little bit daring, so I'm just gonna put a little bit on my first bite. Let's go. Oh my goodness. This has got to be my favorite thing so far. The sourness from the vinegar and the lime just makes it oh it's just perfect like a uh, an explosion of flavor <laughs> Your face. there's a reason why this is a delicacy and so popular especially here in Palawan oh as Shiv said this is going to be our favorite Devin and I are so funny <laughs> we've kind of been eating sweet and savory at the same time you're probably thinking why are they eating dessert and why are they eating chicken like all mixed up well as soon as we see it we eat it so that's how it's going it's just too many good things too many we can't can't help ourselves Ooh, some dessert this looks good we've literally just had the chicken and now why not there is a special dessert that we've been wanting to try. Yes, everybody's recommended it to us. I'm so excited. We finally get to try Hello Hello. I think we're going to have some fun here in Karan. I'm already having the best time just by eating. I mean, the way to your heart is through your stomach, right? <laughs> they actually have something here in the Philippines called a Coke float. Now that brings me straight to my childhood, which is obviously Coke with ice cream on top. And if you've never ever had it, you've like never had a childhood like you should definitely have that and we need to get one because i i haven't had one since i was like five and when we had one when we were so young our parents knew that we were just <laughs> going to be running around jumping off the walls on, going a sugar rush. on a major sugar rice ice cream and coke together it's a disaster for children parents nightmare we don't recommend it no i'm kidding <laughs> oh, oh my, my god. god it's bigger than you I don't know what it is, but I love it. This is crazy. It's got like cornflakes, ice cream, it's got jelly. It's filled to the brim. It's actually leaking all, all over, over my, my hands. So I'm gonna take a little bite of whatever I could find. Ooh. It's sweet. Mmm. It's crispy from the, the cornflakes on top. I want to taste the jelly. Oh, it's coming out the other side. Oh, my God. oh, I need help. There are so many things packed inside of here. Oh, what is this? Oh, my goodness. It's sweet. This must be every Filipino child's best day ever. Because I feel like a kid right now diving into all of like the best things a kid could have. Oh, everything's falling oh, out. Everything's running away. 
Whoa, there's like little jelly beans. Honestly, like a party in a cup. Jelly beans, jelly, ice cream. Oh my god, it's like a treasure hunt. And this was only 95 pesos. Because you've got so much going on here, you don't know what you're gonna get in every bite. So it's kind of like a surprise every time. It's like shredded coconut. There's corn in here. Corn and ice cream. I didn't expect that. Mmm, beans. Mm. Interesting. I didn't expect that either. Thank you so much for watching. <laughs> Take two. I'm trying to do an outro. Thank you so much for watching us explore the city of Quran. In the next few videos, we will be going island hopping, so make sure you subscribe. If you want to see us island hop in El Nido, click here, or one of our favorite videos, click here, and we'll see you in the next one.